Hey, this is Adam Shelton and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video, we're going to talk about the final part of this video series. It's getting started with Active Campaign Part 5 Editions. We've done four videos to help your business. Active Campaign is an email autoresponder to help grow your business and get results as soon as humanly possible by basically following simple steps in Active Campaign emails all over responder it's basically a way of emailing your list on a daily basis now if this is your first time here at this channel go ahead and hit the red subscribe button and a bell right beside the subscribe button right below this video and don't forget to like comment and subscribe that way you get videos just like this now you know what time it is it's time to dive into content on part five the final edition of the active campaign series that i'm doing for you now, Active Campaigns, based out of Chicago, they got a great customer service, you know, organization that help you each and every single day if you have any problems. And by the way, let me show you where the help button is. The help button there, you click on the help button, they'll go ahead and set you up with any question that you have, especially when you first sign up. And by the way, right below this video, I do have a link for you can go ahead and sign up on a 14-day free trial, and you'll go ahead and have up to 100 contacts to start with that way you can start emailing your list as soon as humanly possible and you'll email your list by setting up a basic campaign with a subject line and information in the body go ahead and watch video number one and two that i really talked about setting up a basic campaign you guys should have no problems doing that and of course if you do you can always in the comment line just go ahead and put in the comment line if you have any questions about active campaign and i'll go ahead and get back to you as soon as I can. So part five, we're basically gonna do like a quick little overview and I'll show you something else that did not show you in previous videos. Now, what I really like about it, and I discuss this on every video, I love this dashboard overview that you see everything in front of you, your contact trends, where your contacts are going, like it's up and down in terms of, of adding new subscribers, new potential buyers, potential you know customers into your business. This contact trend has that. Campaigns is all about your emails that you send out. You can create a new email just right there, pretty much. And here's your template right here. So use the templates to set your emails up. And here is the actually campaigns that you send out to your subscribers. Right here is one of my favorite parts of recent activities. As you see, two subscribers in the last two minutes that subscribe to my list. And you get a chance to kind of see exactly what they've done. That's the email address. And he subscribed to two of my lists inside my business. Now, let me go here. Let me show you this real quick. Let me show you one right fast. Well, let me show you one. I didn't show you too much in the previous videos. I want to show you this real, real quick. How powerful active campaigns can be and how it can help you. Now, as you see right here, this person here just subscribed to one of my lists. And over here, it shows the activity what happened three minutes ago, three minutes ago, three, 15 minutes ago. So this person was on my automation email sequences and it shows exactly what's happening inside my business, inside the autoresponder. I love the activity it shows in here, can really show you exactly what an each subscriber is going through. It shows you when they subscribe, it shows you when they click, it shows you when emails are sent to them, it also shows you when they unsubscribe. It actually shows you, you know, if they a message so if it says they unsubscribe or have a message under here and it says they unsubscribe for other reasons and you'll get a chance to see that and you'll understand okay this person's unsubscribed because he didn't want to get my emails anymore but three minutes ago this person just actually opened up my day three email and he clicked on a link that i had inside that email right so he already got the information when he clicked and he opened up the email so this person here is a really good engaged subscriber so i that's what i would call let me move this back over here just want to show you that real fast how powerful that really is and back here it shows you the emails it shows you exactly what emails that you sent to them it kind of shows you pretty much a little bit of a snapchat a snapshot of the emails that i sent to them like call me crazy but i'm a little surprised you still haven't taken me up on this crazy one <laughs> so that was the beginning of the email and apparently it was it was basically he opened it up because he was curious or she was curious she was curious about it, about the email i sent out to her so she was curious about it she opened up the email she clicked on the link and i hope and you know that she's excited about the offer that i set up for her 
all automation, all automation active campaign can set you up as soon as humanly possible. So let me go back here. I just want to show you that because how powerful this is on, on getting started with active campaign part five. Now we went through the campaigns, automation sequences, basically showing all your emails can be scheduled out. I'm going to go to list. List is basically what it is. You can add a list and how you add a list. You just very easy click on add list and you can import your leads right in there. Your customers right inside your list forms are pretty much if you're trying to set up a pretty much a capture page, things like that. And the forms, I don't really work with the forms as much. My areas really are the list automations reports and also that's how to form the forms are pretty much easy to do let me go ahead let me, let me let me just go ahead and do that so create form is pretty much easy you put the name of it and you pretty much set will select what list you want that form to be subscribed to so i don't use the forms as much but it's really easy to use and you do have a customer service help desk there to help you every step of the way but pretty much how this work is pretty much you type in the name of the form and then you want to go ahead and sign up whatever list you want that form to go ahead and go to. So it's pretty much you want them to add their name and email address will be inside the form. And then when they sign up, what list do they go to? So that's where you'll select here and you can go ahead and click on create. Very simple to do. It's really easy to do. I don't work with forms a lot. I think I've done maybe one or two forms before in the past, but I currently don't have any forms right now. I just want to show you an overview of how easy that works. And down here, reports, we went over that yesterday's video of what type of reports that Active Campaign does have. It really does have some really detailed reports about open rates, click through rates, unsubscribes, subscribes, people that was upset about something. It may have that information right there as well. And here's something that we did not go over before was the apps. So the applications here is how you integrate certain things here. So the applications here is how you can integrate active campaign to some of these other organizations here and these are all the applications you can integrate it to so you actually can go right here let me go here right here let me click on one of them here let me click on let's see here what's one that i have here let's say click funnels now i do have active campaign integrated to click funnels so you click on there and it shows you exactly what the information is and you shows you the application process there. You can click right here to get started with ClickFunnels and you can actually integrate ClickFunnels right through ActiveCampaign. So you click on there, it'll teach you to ClickFunnels, then ClickFunnels, you can integrate it right through ActiveCampaign. So I'm gonna do a video about that in the future of how you can use your ClickFunnels account and you can use that to integrate other autoresponders as well. As you know, ClickFunnel is a way you can build capture pages, lead pages, opt-in pages, videos, you have bridge pages. It's a really, really good platform for you to go ahead and grow your business. Really by collecting information, selling products, you know, you can do a bunch of bridge pages. It's a really, really good platform. I'll do future videos on that in the future, but I just want to go over active campaign and show you how you can integrate things together. So let me go back to the overall view here. And as you see here, let me go down one more step. Here's the top context here. This is something I didn't talk about before. It shows you the top context in your overview sequence. So these are all the people who clicks on the emails, open the emails, always engaging inside your business or whatever you're talking about in your email type of strategy. Interaction and also has customer context scoring. So basically, I don't think I have any scoring over them. Oh, we. No, well, we don't have any scoring over there. <laughs> we don't have the score, but you upgrade to get the, the scoring as well. But basically, you can just use the top context pretty much and go ahead and use that as well. And of course, your settings is pretty much your information that you can update inside, kind of like your name, your email address, your phone number, like here, your email address, your phone number, your signature, and then whatever time zone. I'm in American New York time zone based out of the great state of Florida. So that's where I'm at right now. And this is where I was talking about earlier on how you can integrate your information. Like I was talking about earlier about ClickFunnels, you can go right here and integrate your stuff right there as well. So that is a basic overview over Active Campaign, a basic overview from video number one to video number five. As you see, one of the best things I really like about Active Campaign is the recent activities that shows when subscribers are doing something <laughs> either they subscribe they're subscribing unsubscribing 
clicking through your links. That's one of my favorite things. Also, the active content right there. It shows you 9,963 members is in my list totally. Those are one of the favorite things I like about it because it gives you an overview. And especially when you're new to the autoresponder world, the email marketing autoresponder world, you want to have something that you can see. So when you log in, it's good to kind of see what you're working with as well. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to this video and this channel and your 14 free trial, 14 day trial. Click on the link below. I have active campaign. Go ahead and sign up on your trial and you get 100 contacts, up to 100 contacts, but you can go ahead and start emailing, setting up campaign, set up automation sequences, and go ahead and start viewing reports based on that information. I'll see you guys next time on another video from Adam Shelton to help you grow your business. And also, also, we'll see you tomorrow as well. Have a good day. Don't forget to click on the link to go ahead and start your, your trial on ActiveCampaign. I'll see you in tomorrow's video as well. Have a good day.